For the autofocus test, we have the uh, 560mm lens mounted on a K52S and uh, we will test it uh, in the uh, face detect autofocus mode. That is, we do not use live view and uh, we have focused the lens at infinity. It goes a little bit past infinity and we know that the, uh, the socket is about 55 meters away. So uh, here we go. Repeat that a couple of times. So it's relatively fast and very sure-footed. Of course, in practice, uh, you won't necessarily come from infinity to the point in focus, but all, all, only from a few meters away if your bird has moved a little bit. And in that in case, uh, focus is good enough. Let us now start out from 15 meters, say. The lower limit would be 12 meters since we're using the focusing limiter, but let's say 15. And we know the subject is 55 meters away, and let's see what happens. Very sure footed and uh, plenty fast. Of course, in practice, you won't come from that uh, much of a wrong distance, but perhaps a few meters. And you see, if you start out from 50 meters, it's very fast. Let's take a look at the contrast detect autofocus. We have our K52S in uh, live view mode. We know the subject is about 55 meters away and the lens is set uh, past infinity as far as it goes. So, autofocus in uh, contrast detect is slower than in face detect, which is not uh, unexpected but it is uh, it's very accurate. Now we have uh, the camera set at 15 meters. The subject is still uh, at 55 and uh, we will do the second part of the contrast detect autofocus test. I find this uh, performance uh, pretty uh, satisfying for a 560mm lens and uh, it is, as we said before, very accurate. Just for the fun of it, we have um, turned the focusing limit off and uh, focused the lens at its closest focusing distance, 5.6 meters, and the subject is still 55 meters away and let's see what happens. It takes a little while but it's still sure-footed. Face to take out focus, we have the lens set at its minimum focus distance at 5.6 meters. Focus limiter is off. The subject is 55 meters away. So this is a scenario that is basically unrealistic because you would usually use the focusing limiter so that you reduce the travel of the lens. But let's see how this performs in this extreme situation. Basically, there's a long focus throw that the lens has to turn through, but it does focus and it uh, does so accurately, although it takes a little bit of time.